This protocol can be used to perform the real-time simultaneous temperature and stress monitoring of the metal-to-glass structures for the first time. The main advantage of this technique is that the fiber block grating sensor can be well fused with the metal-to-glass structure without destroying the insulation or hermeticity of the metal-to-glass structure. Demonstrating the procedure with Zhi Chunfan will be Kang Jianghu, a master student from INET. To process granulated glass powder, pour approximately 1.1 grams of the powder into a glass cylinder mold and place the mold onto the press machine. To compact the glass into a glass cylinder, switch on the press machine and place the resulting cylinder into a heating furnace to be sintered. Remove the sintered glass cylinder from the heating furnace and use a graphite gasket to manufacture the glass cylinder, the steel shell, and the Kovar conductor. For residual stress measurement, first fuse the head of an optical fiber with an FC connector by the fusion splicers and match the FC connector with an interrogator to demodulate the wavelength and the FPG spectrum. Insert the FPG through a path in the sealing glass of the manufactured MTGS model with the grating of the FPG positioned precisely within the glass. Then fix another FPG near the sealing glass to monitor the temperature only. Connect the interrogator to a computer and use a heat treatment claw to place the sintered glass cylinder, steel shell, FPGs, and covar